This is another Sudoku Primer video. Go to sudokuprimer.com for more, more information. This is puzzle number 60 from Sudoku to Go, Volume 101 by Soap Opera Digest. It's a medium puzzle. There's already a video f um, solving an easy, medium, hard, and diabolical puzzle from this volume, so look for those videos out there on this channel. Um, I want to illustrate uh, a technique here and so I'm going to use an, a medium puzzle so that I, I can focus on the technique and I think there are a lot of examples uh, of this technique on, on, in this puzzle. Uh, the, what I want to uh, talk about today is uh, looking for always being on the lookout for twins, triplets, quadruplets, etc. So first of all, let's just look at um, this middle square. We've got a plus pattern here. And with a plus pattern, if you find any numbers in this column or this row that are outside this square, you'll, you'll find some twins. We've got a 1 and a 4 here in this row, but there's already a 1 and a 4 in, the, in their square. But we have five sevens here, and they're not in here yet, so we know these are five seven twins. And therefore, because we have five seven twins here, we know that these are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine twins right there. So we've already found two sets of twins. We can solve the five seven twins, so I'll put the five and seven there because the because of that seven, but we can't solve the eight nine twins. But since we know these are twins, we can find these twins here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. These are two 6 twins here. And we can't solve those yet either, but we know they're twins. So let's just go through the sections. And when I find uh, um, the possibility of twins or triplets or anything, I'll, I'll illustrate how you can quickly search for them. So we go through one. So one of these can be a one, 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 one. Okay, so only two cells in this square here can be a one because of this one here. And since there's a possibility of twins right here with this one, if we find another number in this row, outside of this square that's not in here yet. It'll be a twin. And we have an 8 here, and so the 8's can't go here, so that is a twin. We have 1 8 twins right here. Uh, we can't solve them because we don't have enough information, but we know that we have another set of twins here because there are only four, four cells in this square that are that are empty. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, so we got three and four twins here. There's a four here, so we can fill in the three, four twins. All right, and uh, let's see if we can find any more fours here. No, four there and four there. So one of these and one of these. We got fours here already. Let's see if we can fill in any more threes. We got a three here and a three here. So one of these is a three, and there's a three. 3, 3, 3, there's a 3, 3, 3, 3, there's a 3 there, uh, 3, let's see, 3, 3, 3, oop, 3, there's a 3 there, so I think we filled in all our 3's now, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, yep, okay, so, because of these 1-8 twins, we found these 4s, and we are also able to fill in all the 3s. Okay, let's continue on. So we have 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. Any of those can be a 1. A 1, 1 here, 1, and a 1 here. So um, you notice we've got two 1s here, so this could be potential triplets. 
with ones and two other with a one and two other numbers. In order to see if these are triplets, we had to well, first of all we had to narrow down the ones, the one to these three cells. To do that, we had to have a one here in both columns. So if we can find two more numbers in these two columns, and they both have to be in both columns, then we'll have triplets here. Got a two here, but no two there. A seven, but we already have a seven here. Threes are all done. So we don't have triplets there, but that's how you quickly look for twins and triplets. Um, I'll give you more examples as we go. We got a one here. One of these is a one. So we could actually look for quadruplets here. The only requirement is we've got numbers here that aren't in the square already because we have a one here and that narrows it down to these four cells. So if we have a five, seven, or three, um, if we don't have a five, seven, or three in this square, then those will be triplets. We've got a three already, so uh, we know that these are one, five, and seven, but we don't know the fourth number. So that's that's how you quickly search for uh, twins, triplets, quadruplets, etc. And you can always be on the lookout for them as you're solving puzzles. Okay, let's see, where were we? Um, let's see, we did uh, twos. I think we finished, did we? I think we just finished one, so let's do twos. We got a two here and a two here. So one of these can be a two. Um, and look at this, we got a nine and a seven here, too. If we have a nine and seven up here, we'd know that these are these are two seven nine triplets. We have a nine, but it's in the wrong row. But one thing we notice here is we've got seven here, seven here, and seven there, so this is a seven. All right. So we didn't find triplets there, but uh, we did find a seven. Okay. So let's continue on. We got a two here and a two here. So one of these has to be a two. So if we have another number in this column and this row that isn't in this square, we'd know we'd have tw uh, twins right there. We've got five, four, seven, three. There's a five here, so that won't work. A four isn't in the column. Seven's already in there, and three's already in there. So no twins there. Okay, we got eight, nine twins there. Let's see, two, two, two. Okay, and then a two, 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 two. So one of these two has to be a two. Do we have a three or a seven? Um, we don't have a seven here, but we do have sevens there so we can fill in that seven so so we've got possibility of twins here with the twos but we don't have another number in here that will work we got uh, six three and four six three and four are already in that square so, okay so okay we got all our threes so we don't need to go through threes let's see four 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 Four, 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 four. So there's a four. Let's see, fives. Five. Five. So here's a possibility of five something twins. We have um, five there and a five there. So we have a seven and a three, but we have a three and seven already in this square, so uh, no twins to be found there. Okay, five, five, five. One of these is a five. Five, five, five. Okay, and five, five. Okay, so one of these is a five. The only other number out there is an outs in this column outside of this square is an eight. We've already got an eight in here, so we don't know its twin. Five's twin there. So we got a five here, twin fives. I mean, ghost fives here. So one of these is a five. And we got a three and a seven. They're already there, so we don't have twins for that five. 
with that five. Okay, and I've got a five here. One of these can be a five. And we got a three and seven already and a one. So we don't have triplets. So I hope you kind of get the idea now um, of how to look for twins and triplets and so forth. Uh, let's continue on. We got six. Six. Six there. There's a six. So one of these two is a six. Six here. Six, six. So that's a six right there. Six, six. So there's six there. So one of these two is a six. Okay, and we got six here. Six. Six, six, six. Okay, so we have ghost sixes there. We have six there, ghost sixes. Six there, so we know that's a six. Okay, uh, so six, 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 six. Sevens, we're all we've got all our sevens already. Seven, 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 seven. Eight, got an eight here. Ghost eight or one eight twins there, and one of these is an eight. Do we have triplets here? An eight here. So one of these is an eight. Seven's already there. Three's already there. Six is already there. So one of these is a four and one of these is an eight. So we don't have triplets there yet. Eight, eight, eight. So one of these is an eight. We know one of these is an eight. Got eight, nine twins there. One of these is an eight. Okay, we got an eight here. Eight. All right, and then nines. Nine here. Nine, nine. So we got a nine there. Yeah. So, and look at this. We've here are some twins. We've got a two here. So one of these is a two and one of these is a two and nines one of these is a nine one of these is a nine so we have two nine twins uh, that is because we have wh what we call a gate pattern here we've got two numbers with an open gate um, and the two nines are already in this column so therefore this two can only fit here and therefore only here and this nine can only fit here and therefore here so we found these twins because of this gate pattern right here. Okay. Um, and we've got a 2 there, so we know this is a 9. And that's a 2. And now we can solve these 8, 9 twins. So 8 there and a 9 there. And we've got, if you remember, we had potential triplets here, 1s, and we've got 9s there now. And we got 6s. So now we have triplets here. One, six, nine. Okay, let's see if we can solve those. We got a six there and a nine there. So we got a nine and a nine, so that's a nine. A six here. One of these is a six, one of these is a six. And ones. Nope, we can't solve any more, but we did find the, the nine there. Okay. Now, since we know what these two numbers are, 1 and 6, we can, we can find these triplets. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 2, 5, and 8. There's a 2 right there, and there's an, a 2 and an 8, so that's a 5. I didn't notice the column was all all filled in except for the 5 at the bottom, so we could have found it that way too. But now we know this is 2, 8, and this is 1, 6. So 2, 8 here, we we can finish this. With these twins here, we can finish this column. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So that's a 5. So now we have a 5, 5, and a 5 there. Five, five, and a five there. Five, five, five there. Five, five, five there. Five, five. Okay.
Okay, I think we've got all our fives now. Let's look here. We've only got a one, six, one and six missing. There's a six, so that's a six right there, and a one. So now we know that one of these is a one, and we have what um, two eight twins there, one six twins there. So this is a one, and this is a six. And uh, oh, I didn't see that eight before. So there's a two eight. There's our two eight twins. So now we have an eight here, an eight here. So one of these is an eight. One of these is an 8, so with double column elimination we know that one of these is an 8. We have an 8 here, we don't know, let's see if we can find a twin for that. We've got 9's here, so these are 8, 9 twins, so this has to be a 2. Because 8's 8, and a 9, 9, 9, so that's a 2 right there. Now we've got one eight here, I believe. Yeah, one eight, one eight, one eight, one eight. We've got eight nines here. One, so this is a two. Okay, so we have one eight here, one eight here. We got one, two, three, four, eight, nine there, four eight there. We can fill this number in. Oh, that's a two because there are two six twins that we found at the beginning. That's another thing about finding twins. Even if you can't solve them, later on when you fill in one of the numbers, you'll remember that there was a twin there. So it makes it easier to find uh, uh, the, the number. Or, or you'll remember what, what number it is and you can fill it in. Let's see what this column has missing. Four, eight, nine, four and eight. There's a four, so that's an eight, four. Okay, so now we have our eight, nine twins there. We've got an eight there. We're only missing one number here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And what are we missing here? One, six, seven, eight, one and six. And there's a six there. Six. What are we missing here? One, two, four, nine. One, two, four, nine. There's a, there are two. There's a, let's see, two, two. So there's a two. One, 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 four. Four, four, four. So that's a four right there. And so we're missing one and nine. There's a nine. So that's a one and that's a nine. That'll help us fill in our one eights there. One there, eight there. So this one eight twins that we found at the very beginning of the puzzle, we are just able to fill in now. Kind of interesting sometimes. Then we got four eight here. There's a four. So eight, four, and then we got one eights there. There's an eight there and one there. So that's an eight, and that's a one. All right. Well, I hope that helped you uh, see how you can look for twins and triplets and other sets um, very quickly, just by scanning the rows and columns and looking for numbers that are missing. Um, I hope that helped. Uh, this technique helps you um, solve puzzles quicker and makes it more fun. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.